Hello, everyone. So I'm going to take us through some of the new analytics features. Um, Lars is going to follow me and go over some of the additional functionality that's been added to analytics or is supporting analytics, but is more properly placed in the platform product stream. Just two quick points before we really jump into it. The first one is that the line listing app is now on continuous delivery. So just as Marcus was pointing out, we are able to continuously release the line list with new improvements and, and bug fixes. So as long as there's not backend um, uh, functionality that is required for the corresponding front end. Um, so this hopefully means that we'll be a little bit more responsive to your request for the line list that we can Im make improvements continuously and then make those available to all of you. Um, the latest feature hogging uh, is now going to be in 2.39. The next point here is we have made a lot of good progress on new um, plugin for the dashboard. Uh, this has been a collaborative effort between the analytics team and the platform team. This means that the dashboard plugins will be more secure, performant, and allow for better offline caching. Um, unfortunately, there we did not complete the line listing plugin for 239, this initial release of 239, but we're hopefully going to get it in as soon as possible. So now jumping right into the features, in the line listing app, we have added a new time dimension. That's the scheduled date. You see it there highlighted on the slide with the arrow pointing to it. So you can use this scheduled date time dimension just like you use any of the other time dimensions. So you can add it to columns or filter by it. We also have scheduled event status available in the line listing app as well. So if you go see where the arrow, the blue arrow on the left is pointing, you see event status. When you open that, uh, you can see that you can choose active, completed, or scheduled. If you choose scheduled, then you'll only see those events that are scheduled. Um, uh, and this allows you to, say, see um, scheduled events that are scheduled for today, tomorrow, next week. Um, so hopefully a very pragmatic and useful tool to, uh, to maybe users at lower levels to see what's coming up um, in their work, work routines.